This is the first website I want you to be at. This is Audacity, a program that lets you record your own voice if you have a microphone, and it also lets you record what you hear through your computer speakers. This basically lets you record anything you can listen to on the internet, so you can basically get a lot of your favorite music free. Download Audacity with permission from your parents if you're using their computer. If it's your computer, have at it. Install it by following the directions it provides. Once it's installed, you need to make sure of a few things in your own computer. I'm only familiar with the Windows operation system, so if you use anything else, you're on your own. Sorry. First, you need to make sure that your system's set to accept stereo sound. To do this, go to Control Panel through your Start menu. To make this easy, make sure you are viewing your control menu in Classic View. Click on the sound icon. Right click on any of the devices you see and make sure that your disabled or disconnected devices are being shown. After doing this, you should be able to see the stereo mix visible, if it wasn't already. This is what you need to record what you hear through your computer speakers. After these things are done, namely installing Audacity and making sure the stereo mix option is visible, you can record anything that you can hear through your computer speakers. Now let's do it! It's time to open Audacity. Notice this drop down box that shows these devices in your computer. What this program is doing is showing you the available devices your computer has to record with. If you don't see stereo mix, it either means you did something wrong or your computer is missing something vital to its system. Assuming the best, you want to set Audacity to accept stereo input. Once this is done, anything you're listening to can be recorded by pressing the record button in Audacity. Now let's change topics. You can drag a song into Audacity, go to File and select Import, or right click on a song and choose Open with Audacity. What this will do is bring the song into view for editing and saving. Since we want a wave format of song for Miku Miku Dance, simply click File and choose Export and you will see the different types of formats Audacity can render in the folders drop down box shown. Select Wave from the list. Let's say there is a song you've heard on YouTube that you would like played in MMD. Open Audacity. Make sure it's set to record your stereo mix, and then click the record button. Now start the music. Once it's done, you can save it as a WAV file in the method I've described. Congratulations! You now have a song or audio clip in WAV format that is suitable for Miku Miku Dance. Thanks for watching! Thanks for your support! And all those other formalities.